Tanya, a 13-year-old curious city girl studying in class 8. Kabir, Sanya's 14-year-old brother, who helps her contemplate things and perform various activities. Mummy, Sanya's mother, who facilitates them in understanding different concepts. Chaja ji, a 40-year-old farmer who helps Sanya understand various agricultural concepts and provides an insight in most of her explorations. So far we learn about the causes of deforestation to satisfy human needs, natural calamities, about the dangerous consequences of deforestation, increased pollution, decreased soil fertility, increased temperature, floods, drought, safe forests, plant trees. Bhaiya, look at that animal. Which animal is this? It looks like a squirrel, doesn't it? Beta, this is a squirrel only. A squirrel? This big? The squirrels that I have seen near our house and in the village were smaller than this. In fact, their color was also different. Maybe these squirrels are found in this region only, isn't it Chacha Ji? Rightly said Kabir, these squirrels are found in some specific areas only. Oh, do you mean that there are plants and trees that grow only in specific areas and regions? I have seen these flowers and trees only here and nowhere else. These are palash flowers and these are babool trees. Yes, this is the flora of Jharkhand. Flora meaning the plants found in a specific region, isn't it? Absolutely right, Sanya. Friends, what kind of plants and animals can be seen in the region where you live? Do tigers also live in this region? On our way, I saw a signboard saying Betla National Park, Palamo Tiger Reserve. I have heard the population of tigers is decreasing. Yes, Sanya. Tiger is one such animal that is slowly vanishing from our forests. The government has declared some areas as tiger reserve areas for safety of these tigers. Oh, yes, just like rhinos. The government has declared few regions as reserve area for safety of rhinos. Friends, is it only the big animals that are in danger of extinction? Are there any other animals that are in danger too? What do you think? Some endangered species are Western Tragopan, Elephant, Tiger, Horned Antelope, etc. It's good to know that the government is also doing so much to protect these animals. Why do you think is it important to conserve these animals? Mm, I think plants, trees and animals all are important for the environment as we all are dependent on each other in some way. Friends, can you help me find answers to these questions? Sanya, 
Do you know about other animals that are in danger too? Chacha ji, I have heard that the population of wild buffalo, reindeer and vulture is decreasing. Friends, do you know about any endangered species? Can you name them? Do these national parks have reserved areas for all the animals? Sanya, actually these are biosphere reserve areas. These protected areas for flora, fauna and geologists are reserved and managed for the purpose of conservation and to provide opportunities for study and research work. A biosphere reserve area can have several other protected areas. Look at these pictures of Panchamadi Biosphere Reserve Area in Madhya Pradesh. Yes, but do you think animals get the same kind of environment as they get in the forests? I think neither the animals get the same environment like in the forests, nor they are able to move around freely outside their cages. Hmm, that is why wildlife sanctuaries are made in forests so that the animals can live freely and safely in a natural environment. Yes, Bhaiya, after all, even the animals have a right to live freely on earth like us humans. Friends, find out if there is any biosphere reserve area, national park or wildlife sanctuary in the region where you live. Bhaiya, look! There are so many birds in this river. I have never seen such birds before. Do you know these birds have flown here from different parts of the world? Oh, aren't these the migratory birds? I have read about migratory birds in class 7. Friends, I'm sure you would know why these birds migrate from one place to another. Can you tell why? We learned about plants and animals found in particular regions, special regional trees and plants, endangered animals. The government has introduced various plans programs and areas to conserve forests and animals like biosphere reserve area, national park, wildlife sanctuary, birds that migrate from one place to another.